welcome to the 2022 graduation and admission ceremony for the Chartered Institute of Legal Executives. Today is a truly magical day, both for all the students and for me and for Silex, because what it does is it recognises all of the hard work that everyone has put in. Always go a little bit further into the water than you feel you're capable of. Go a little bit out of your depth. And when you feel like your feet aren't quite touching the bottom, you're in the right place to do something exciting. Graduating today means quite a lot to me because it's the end of such a long journey and such hard work, so it feels nice to celebrate it with other members. Um, it means a lot to me today to be graduating. Um, didn't think I'd get here, but I have, and I'm really proud of myself. And you will know, having worked as hard as you have to earn your place here today, how much grit, how much resilience, how much stomach are, is required to practice law. The graduation day is a positive, enlightening experience, so the best bit about it for me is that I get to talk to the graduates but also their families and I get to hear the stories and their experiences of their study journey, why they joined Silex and most importantly the opportunity that Silex has given them. For many of them, they wouldn't have been able to pursue a career in the law if it wasn't for the flexibility of the Silex route. Uh, it was an amazing journey with the Silex. You can divide your time with the study, with your family members, with your work life as well. I was already working in a law firm without any law formal training or degree. It seemed like the most sensible and effective way of becoming a lawyer whilst being able to work as well. This is my uh, second graduation because I studied already in Italy and I'm an Italian uh, qualified lawyer. Silex was just perfect for me because I already had a, a kind of uh, legal background but of course it was not the one I needed here. So Silex just gave me the opportunity uh, to start working here in, uh, in the UK.